Our workforce has been fairly stable, right around 300 employees total, with the exception of over the last course of the last three years, we've started to add engineering resources. I'm safe to say that I'm probably overstaffed in my skilled workforce, and I, I challenge any company in the area to be able to say that. Everybody I have is a journeyman, but 75% of them are graduated apprenticeships using Northwest State. We, we retain about 90, 95% of uh, apprenticeships that we grow and turn into journeymen. I can't say enough about the apprenticeship program. What we've been able to do is through CTS, they, they have the repertoire of classes that we can send people to, engineers, people from the floor as needed. We're always going to them. We've done electrical training, we've done Microsoft Project, Excel, basic training, negotiation training. It's worth putting the time and effort into them. I think it's something that's uh, valuable to me. I think it's great that Chase does that. They care about their employees and they're willing to um, invest the time, invest the money. So if we find a need in the company that we need training for, we can call CTS and they will find a class and create the class for us. The national standard for electrical safety in the workplace mandates that uh, everybody needs to be retrained every three years. So we partnered with Northwest State and CTS to come on site to train all of our engineers, maintenance people, and supervisors. The instructor coming in over the different shifts that we have, and we have five different shifts here. People didn't have to go out of their way to travel to Northwest State. It freed up a lot of resources here. I mean, it comes down to it, Northwest State just, is just a good school to work with. And good people, very, very proactive, very easy to work with. To continue to be the leader in our industry, grow our business, we need CTS, the partnership with them, to be able to get the classes, to be able to provide for our customers what they truly need.